Right guys, Mark Crossfield here, Cleveland RTX 588 wedges. This is the CB version, little cavity back. Okay. Um, similar face, Rotex grooves, all those on a Rotex face and the grooves and everything. So let's give the RTX Cleveland 588 CB <laughs> a little bit of a test. Let's get stuck in. Right, Stephen, uh, RTX 588 CB, you get a little bit of a cavity back. So this one is going to bridge that gap for people like me who have maybe bigger cavity back diets. Do you see what I mean? And don't want to go right down into that bladed wedge. Um, the only thing with this club for me, I like the concept of that. Um, I actually quite like a bladed iron and this just looks a bit too big for me. It, it's not my it's not my favorite look it's certainly bigger than the other version i think it will appeal to a lot of golfers for me though as someone who uses very chunky kind of irons out of context irons almost i still want to stay very traditional in my wedges but i think compared to like compared to your chunkiness oh yeah that's still much that's nicer so much better. yeah it's a real bridging one so if you're going into this brand's irons and you don't want their bladed irons this wedge uh, is the one that's going to kind of give you that little bit of cross between the two. I don't feel particularly any difference in feel, power, for it being slightly cavity back to the bladed one, do you? It's the shape more that's changing yeah, it for me. Yeah, the shape, and I, I like a slightly more compact, slightly yeah. sharper edges. So, yeah, yeah. So that's the reason I'm not as keen as this one compared to the other one. But if you think, again, if you're using a cavity, a big chunky. The other ones might be a massive shock. Yeah, so it's going to look similar. So, Spe especially if you, so like this is the 56, if you've got the 52. Yeah, yeah. It's going to really, it, it will progress with your set far better. Yeah, absolutely. And I think that's a really good point. You know, we review these clubs, but we have our preconceptions in there already from stuff we've used before and what have you. If you're coming into golf and you've not got those preconceptions, haven't played for a while, you might not care what wedge you have, or you might pick up the bladed one and, like I say, just feel like it's not going to do as much as you want it to do. Definitely you will get a, maybe a little bit more of a consistent strike pattern across the face on yeah. fuller shots, with it being that slightly cavity yeah, that, back. That, that would kind of be the question that I would be asking, is what sort of shots are you going to be playing with it? Yeah. So like I say, if you're a 52 and you tend to not like half shots and you use your 52 full out yeah. all the time? Yeah, yeah, yeah makes perfect sense to get this one. Yeah, absolutely. And, um, and results-wise, for me, the shots are no different. Yeah, it's, 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 it's uh, nice. I think if you blindfolded me... Oh, go in! Please go in! Why does it not go in, Stephen? Um, uh, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. It's literally the physical look, the size of it. But like Steve says so well, I think for lots of people, actually, that look might appeal. Yeah? yeah? Uh, RTX 588, cavity back liking it and i get what it's there for i think it's a from a wedge specialist company someone who's got they're going to have a massive fitting car kind of presence out yeah. there in the shops which i think is great for people to go out there fit this one in with lofts to your set and that's the key thing fitting in the look the lofts the distances into your set which that fitting car uh, cleveland are saying is going to give you those options because that is a problem with wedges isn't it there's you just can't have a go of them enough testing no. for customers no. and that's something they're trying to tackle which is great good stuff thanks for your time stephen thank you uh rtx 588 cleveland wedge post comments down below cavity back or not is it something you love or hate something you think about using thanks for watching thanks for watching find more videos subscribe to my youtube channel find me on facebook mark crossfield also on twitter at four golf online and loads of fun pictures going up on instagram at crossfield mark